Extreme Makeover Home Edition is a television program that has taken on some projects with uh, enormous odds and introduced everyone to some remarkable families. But the latest episode that aired last night, I think, uh, showed everyone something really wonderful. And ABC's Bob Woodruff is at the, at the site of the new home in Oak Park, Michigan, and he is with the Lucky family this morning. Bob? Charlie, I, I'll introduce you to them in a, in a minute, but you know, every once in a while in this business, as you know, you run, run across a story that really does move you. This is one of them. It involves this house, some new technology, and a remarkable family that has had to overcome unbelievable odds. Guys, we're rolling in Detroit. Yeah. Motor City. Yeah. Now, we're outside of Oak Park, Michigan to go meet the Varden family. Now, this family has truly a unique situation. Take a look at the Varden family's application video. My name is Larry. My wife is. My name is Judy. These are my two boys. My name is Stefan. And then this is my brother, Lance. So Larry and Judy have known each other most of their lives. They've been deaf since birth. They've got two sons, Stefan, who's 14, amazing kid, really cool, and kind of works as the family's interpreter. So Stefan's younger brother, Lance, has a little more difficulty communicating. He was born blind. On top of that, a few years back, he was diagnosed as autistic. Judy, Larry, Stefan, and Lance, good morning, Varden family. You guys ready to go on vacation? Yeah? Yep. Go ahead, get in the limo. I have a message from Ty. Thank you. Good morning! Today, we say goodbye to your old house. Welcome home, Varden family! Bus driver, move that bus! Take a look at your new house! Oh. Walk through that door and into a whole new house and a whole new life. Now we're back here in this uh, amazing new house with this fa the Varden family, Larry, Judy, and Stefan, who, by the way, it's his 15th birthday today. <laughs> Judy, I want you to explain first. We, we should say that before this room was very cut up, it was difficult for you to communicate with your family because you have to sign. Now, completely different. Our, before, we had a wall right here, and I was always in the kitchen. My husband was always in the living room. And if I cook, I would have to go all the way around the wall to communicate with him and then go back into the kitchen to work. Now with the wall removed, it's an open floor plan here, I can communicate quite freely with, freely with my husband. And there's more communication than we've had before, and I really do love it. It's really changed your life. Oh, yes, it has. Big time. Now, people that saw the show remember that, that Lance, the young boy who's autistic and blind, would sometimes bolt from the house. Larry, has this changed that situation for you with these surveillance cameras, which, by the way, are mounted in every room? Before, um, now with this new security system we have it, it shows me exactly where Lance is and where he's going. There he is right there. There he is. And you can watch him when he, when he leaves the house. And this gives us a lot of relief now. Stefan, you had a lot of concerns about your brother. Yes, I do. Show did. me this device you've got now. And this device, this thing, atta it, it attaches to his clothing or pants. And whenever he leaves the house, it notifies us from this machine and notifies the authorities that he's left the house and that the authorities can track him down and bring him back safely. So it is a tracking device. Right. You know, there's, a, there's an alarm that goes off. Can you show us in the bedroom, Larry and Judy? Uh, obviously, if you're deaf, you can't hear the alarm. So this is the other thing that the team has put in the house. And Stefan, I'm going to have you set this off when you're uh, when you're ready. Uh, go ahead. So before you couldn't hear an alarm. Now what? 
This is what you can see what this is happening. This may this this lets me know if something's happening to land. Before we would we didn't have this device, now we do, so we can feel it and with this light. And now we would have to go and check on lands right away. I wonder if you should tell me the story you told me before about your hearing aids. You never had a hearing aid before in your adult life. About 25 years ago, I had a hearing aid, and it wasn't very good. The sound was very garbled. Now, the technology that we have, the hearing aid, I mean, I can pick up so many different sounds. I can hear my boys' voices, so many things that I can hear now. It's very exciting to be able to hear it. And this is the first hearing aid you've had. You just got this recently. Yes. I'd say about three weeks ago, I received it, and I can, I'm picking up a lot of things quite fast. And Larry, you're going to get one as well? Yes, next week I'm flying to Minnesota, and I'm going to get a hearing aid, finally. I'm excited about that. That's great news, Liz. Thank you very much, and thank you to both of you. You know, Charlie, once in a while you run across people who truly deserve what they get. This is one of those occasions. Back to you. It is always neat to see homes made over that quickly, but in this case, very special. Extreme Makeover Home Edition airs Sunday nights on ABC.